Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, had predicted that Tesla would rank as the most valuable firm on the planet, but this hasn't happened yet. In fact, Tesla is paving the way to accomplish this goal. With Tesla's stock already trading below 180.45, it won't be long until it crosses the 200-point barrier and likely reaches $400 per share before the end of this month. According to Brett Winton, Director of Research at ARC Investment, Tesla is poised for a significant upswing in 2023. He predicts that in the next five years, electric vehicles, EVs, will rule the market and that by 2027, 60 million electric vehicles will have been sold worldwide, with Tesla accounting for a significant portion of this total. Hi everyone, and happy return to Tesla for tomorrow. The demand for Tesla cars has increased dramatically over the last few weeks. Despite initial concerns about a potential decline in demand, it appears that things are turning around, and it is very likely that demand will rise even further in the months to come after Tesla's Q4 production and delivery figures are revealed. According to a number of forecasts, the fourth quarter of 2022 will see an even greater drop in the demand for Tesla vehicles. Based on the company's vehicle deliveries, Tesla produced about 439,000 vehicles and delivered about 400 and 5,000 of them. Chrome production increased from 47% to 1.37 million, but the percentage of the total fell from 40% to 1.3 million. Despite a decline in production at its Shanghai facility in China, Tesla achieved a record-breaking fourth quarter, while some analysts argue that these numbers were below the wall. Street projects around 427,000 deliveries during the year's last quarter an internal note from the car manufacturer stated that it had halted production at its Shanghai plant in December, ahead of schedule from its original plan to halt the majority of operations at the plant in the final week of the year. Several Tesla investors had anticipated a sharp drop in the company's delivery figures due to the production delay. Nonetheless, Tesla outperformed their expectations. Brett Winton claims that Tesla's Q4 results are unprecedented. He continued by saying that the stock price might reach $400 this year if the next quarter saw better production rates. Let's find out. But before we get started, please make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and enable notifications so you can keep informed about everything Tesla does. This was stated by Brett Wynn. According to recent claims from Tesla's Investor Day, the Cybertruck may arrive earlier than anticipated. Tesla plans to adhere strictly to Elon Musk's vision, with the first truck delivery scheduled for the third quarter of this year, and Elon Musk the CEO of Tesla, had predicted that Tesla would rank as the most valuable firm on the planet, but this hasn't happened yet. In fact, Tesla is paving the way to accomplish this goal. With Tesla's stock already trading below 180.45, it won't be long until it crosses the 200-point barrier and likely reaches $400 per share before the end of this month. According to Brett Winton, Director of Research at ARC Investment, Tesla is poised for a significant upswing in 2023. He predicts that in the next five years, electric vehicles, EVs, will rule the market and that by 2027, 60 million electric vehicles will have been sold worldwide, with Tesla accounting for a significant portion of this total. Hi everyone, and happy return to Tesla for tomorrow. Demand for Tesla cars has increased dramatically over the last few weeks. Despite initial concerns about a potential decline in demand, it appears that things are turning around and it is very likely that demand will rise even further in the months to come after Tesla's Q4 production and delivery figures are revealed. According to a number of forecasts, the fourth quarter of 2022 will see an even greater drop in the demand for Tesla vehicles. Based on the company's vehicle deliveries, Tesla produced about 439,000 vehicles and delivered about 405,000 of them. Grown production increased from 47% to 1.37 million, but the percentage of the total fell from 40% to 1.3 million. Despite a decline in production at its Shanghai facility in China, Tesla achieved a record-breaking fourth quarter, while some analysts argue that these numbers were below the wall. Street projects around 427,000 deliveries during the year's last quarter. An internal note from the car manufacturer stated that it had halted production at its Shanghai plant in December ahead of schedule from its original plan to halt the majority of operations at the plant in the final week of the year. Several Tesla investors had anticipated a sharp drop in the company's delivery figures due to the production delay. Nonetheless, Tesla outperformed their expectations. Brett Winton claims that Tesla's Q4 results are unprecedented. 
He continued by saying that the stock price might reach $400 this year, the next quarter saw better production rates. Let's find out. But before we get started, please make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and enable notifications so you can keep informed about everything Tesla does. This was stated by Brett Wynn. According to recent claims from Tesla's Investor Day, the Cybertruck may arrive earlier than anticipated. Tesla plans to adhere strictly to Elon Musk's vision, with the first truck delivery scheduled for the third quarter of this year, and approximately 1,000 deliveries overall. Starting next year, volume production is also anticipated, although there has been a rapid shift from ICE cars to electric vehicles, which has expanded Tesla's EV markets. Some analysts still think that demand for these cars is gradually diminishing, despite the fact that Tesla has seen significant demand for its EVS in recent years. Adam Jonas, an analyst at Morgan Stanley, said at some point last year that demand destruction is most certainly occurring for Tesla. This analyst stated that shorter lead times and price reductions in the upcoming months will be indicative of the downturn in demand for Tesla cars, which is why he lowered his base case price objective for the company's stock from $383 to $350. There are signs that demand for Tesla is strong, but there are other aspects as well, including the wait times for the Tesla EVS in certain of its regions, that could raise concerns. For certain of its electric vehicle models, Tesla has seen reductions in the wait times for deliveries on new orders. Some analysts speculate that this could be a sign of declining demand. During an August event hosted by Tesla in its Berlin Gigafactory, Pierre Ferragu, managing partner of New Street Research stated that he believes the company would face extraordinary demand in the future. As per his statement, the current demand for electric cars has beyond the expectations of a few years ago, and the ability of Tesla and its rivals to increase car volumes will likely determine their market shares. Tesla has increased the price of its vehicles during the past two years, but the automaker has also started to reduce the cost of certain of its models. Tesla reportedly dropped the price of certain of its EVS models in China, with some models seeing price reductions of up to 13%. Following the announcement of price drops, Tesla received 30000 orders in three days, according to reports from the Chinese local media. Clearly, many EV customers jumped at the chance to get a Tesla EV for themselves. Nevertheless, even while Tesla has benefited greatly from these price reductions, and they have paved the way for strong revenue growth this year, they inadvertently lend credence to the theory that Tesla was actually having demand problems. Some observers claim that Tesla's price reduction was prompted by indications of waning demand and heightened competition in the biggest auto market in the world. Elon Musk might be selling Tesla shares once more, which is something to think about at a time when the manufacturer is having 